Geology in a jiffy. What's in the bag? It's... The nitrogen cycle. Nitrogen, with a symbol capital N, is found here on the periodic table and is modelled with a blue ball as one atom of nitrogen. In our atmosphere, nitrogen is found as a gas, as molecules of two atoms bonded together with the formula N2. It's making up 78% of our atmosphere, which is a lot. So our molecules of nitrogen need to get from the air into the soil so plants can grow, then return to the atmosphere. But this is not a simple process, and this process is called the nitrogen cycle. Take this soil, blow our atmosphere, where the nitrogen molecules are. In the air, the nitrogen needs to be converted to nitrates in the soil, so they can be absorbed by the roots of plants to help plants make proteins. These then eaten by animals, so they can help make more proteins. But the process is not that simple. To get nitrogen in the air into the soil can be achieved by one of six ways. The first is a natural way using plants. These plants being called legumes and include peas, peanuts and clover. These legumes having nodules in their root systems where bacteria live and these bacteria love nitrogen. These bacteria lock or fix the nitrogen into the soil with the nitrogen fixing bacteria in root nodules helping make nitrates in the soil. The second way is also natural and again involves bacteria, they living in the soil, fixing bacteria into the soil from the air. The third way is also natural and helps put nitrogen into the soil by using the lightning from storms to help make nitrates in our soils. The fourth way is by artificial ways with humans using fertilizers such as via an NPK fertilizer, the N standing for nitrogen mixed with phosphorus and potassium, these dug directly into our soils, adding nitrogen into the soil. Wow! So nitrates now in the soil can be absorbed by plant roots into plants where they are used to help make proteins. The plants are then eaten by animals to help make proteins in the animal, which will ultimately make waste in the form of urine of faeces, which gives us our fifth method of getting nitrogen into the soils, another natural way using bacteria which decay, dead plant material, dead animal material, and animal waste, into the soil, adding to the nitrogen levels in the soil. The sixth and last way is also natural, and again use bacteria, that live in the soil and help the nitrogen from the decaying materials be absorbed into the soil, these bacteria called nitrifying bacteria. So we have six different ways to get nitrogen from the air into the soil, but there is only one way to move the nitrogen from in the soil into the air. Instead of using nitrifying bacteria, the denitrifying bacteria help break down nitrogen compounds in the soil, so releasing nitrogen into the air. The nitrogen cycle. That's amazing. Please do watch our videos on the carbon cycle and the water cycle. Please subscribe to my channel. Bye!